What's up, YouTube? Ultimate Locks here, and we're gonna go over this auctions of one. And uh, yeah, as you can see here, I have quite a few packages. Uh, I was only expecting like one or two today, and I ended up getting like ten. So uh, yeah, let's check it out. Move everything over here, and I guess this will be the first package we open. And where's my box cutter? There's my box cutter. So. Okay, I need to have my mouse and everything over here, that way I can check to see the auction. Well, I guess I don't really need to check, I'll check everything afterwards. But we have Pokemon Pearl, okay, authentic Pokemon Ruby, which is always nice, Pokemon Gold, Super Smash Bros, check the condition of the disc. Uh, that just does not look like it will play. Like you guys can see that there's like a line right here. Yeah, you guys see that line. I don't know if that's a crack or or what, but it doesn't look like it's gonna play. So make sure to test it out later. Pokemon XD Gala Darkness. That disc looks like, or not this. This is Pokemon Coliseum, but this disc is how a used disc could be. There's a few scratches, but there's nothing major. Oh. <laughs> okay, so this was XD, but it was Pokemon Coliseum and Pokemon XD's and Pokemon Coliseum's case. And this has quite a few scratches, but it looks like it should play. So both the Pokemon GameCube games are good. Uh, Super Smash Bros. Melee, on the other hand, might not be as good. So I'll put this back in there. Set this over here, and let's go with this big box. Big box is always the best. I see a wind waker. All right, so quite a bit of stuff here. keep this box here just in case anything looks iffy so GameCube cable awesome Pokemon Sapphire Pokemon Emerald Pokemon Blue Pokemon Crystal Pokemon eBay message uh, we got Zelda Wind Waker Wind Waker looks in near mint condition See, this is how every game should be taken care of. You put the game in the GameCube, and then you take the game out of the GameCube. It's not that hard. Very good condition. That Zelda was near mint. I might actually keep that one. Uh, Sunshine's in like very good condition. It's not near mint, but extremely good. Paper Mario, very good. Check out Twilight Princess. Very, very good. Okay, Pokemon Soul Silver. Ouch. That's gonna have to get returned. This is a Pokemon Soul Silver. I actually don't have, uh, I've never actually owned a fake copy. So, uh, yeah. This is uh, what a fake copy looks like. Let me go grab a real one. This is what a real one looks I mean, this is what a fake one looks like, this is what a real one looks like. And you could say, oh, the picture's just faded, but it's not that, it's the case. The case is gray, right? This is a real one. The case is black. Soul Silver and HeartGold are in black cases. If you see them in gray cases, that means that they are fake. Doesn't matter what region they're from, they're fake. So, that's gonna have to be returned. Right side, I might be able to get a Pokemon Soul Silver case because this is an authentic case, which sadly I feel bad for the guy because he probably bought this either off of eBay or at GameStop. 
And GameStop, they don't know what the hell they're doing. Uh, Pokemon Diamond looks to be authentic. Actually, that's really weird because this isn't an authentic game case. This is a fake game case. You can see here, there's no Nintendo logo right here. There's no D GBA thing. It's just a really cheap case. But the box art is authentic. I believe it is. Looks pretty authentic to me. Actually, maybe it's not. Let me go check. Uh, I'll do that later. It looks as authentic as hell of just the case art, but clearly this is a fake. So uh, let me put this in here. These are the Game Boy games that uh, we got. So we have Pokemon Crystal, Pokemon Blue, Pokemon Gold, Pokemon Silver, Pokemon Yellow. So there we go. As you can see here, got them Pokemon games. And I'll just put them in here for now because I need to test all this stuff. guys didn't see that, you guys don't need to know my address, hopefully you didn't see it, I don't want to have to put this through Sony Vegas, it's always annoying as hell. Super Smash Bros! Melee. What is the condition of the disc? Is it good? It is, uh, it's goodish. It, it looks pretty good. Looks like it'll play fine. So, just to be on the safe side, let me put this through case. Or not the case, but the package. Pokemon Diamond! I think I got this for eight dollars. <laughs> And it's kind of weird. Looks like there should be a square here, but. Huh. Let's put this back in here. And this is a pretty big package, so. Let's check this out. Nothing in there. So we have Mario Sunshine. Let's check the condition of this. Uh, it's in kind of good condition. Well, it's not really. I Okay, it's in good condition, but it looks like it has, like, crap on it. Like, not actual crap, but, yeah, I don't know. It just has some, like, weird stuff at the top right here. You can see it, little smudges, but hopefully that will just come right off. I highly doubt it would be playable if it didn't. Uh, that's pretty scratched up. I'm crossing. And that's pretty scratched up. Have to see what we gotta do about those. As long as they play, they'll play, but. Hopefully Sunshine will get cleaned off because Sunshine's not that bad. But yeah, Animal Crossing looks kind of like it might not play. And I think this is the last package? Yeah. So. Just open up this side.
okay. Pokemon White. Nothing in it. So this is the Pokemon White, it's Platinum, and I want to say Pearl. Yeah. So we have Pokemon Pearl, we have Pokemon Platinum version, and it doesn't have a game in it. But also this Pokemon Pearl, supposedly its pens are bent, and it will play sometimes. So we'll have to see about that. It's kind of weird that uh, you somehow break a DS game. That that must take a lot of effort. But I got this, I think, for all around $11. So it, this case right here is worth it to me because I have a Pokemon Pearl. I mean, not Pokemon Pearl. Pokemon Platinum without a case. And I also have a Pokemon White without a case. So it's always nice to get cases for that. And then we have this Pokemon Pearl that... Uh, Kind of iffy, like, yeah, see about that, see if it works. Anyways guys, thank you for watching, make sure to comment, rate, and subscribe, this is just a mail opening, so, I don't know, I think I got quite a few goodies today, hopefully I'll get uh, one of the packages I've been waiting on, because it was a pretty big package, and it looks like USPS lost it, because it was last updated, uh, what was it, uh, I think it was updated September 8th, and right now it is September 17th, and uh, yes, it was mailed on September 8th, updated, and then has not been updated since, so most likely they lost it, which really sucks, because that was a really good deal that I got on eBay. Anyways guys, thanks for watching, peace out.